GTA 5 came out in 2013. It's 2021, almost 10 years, and we have still not gotten GTA 6, and I've had enough. <laughs> so what I did was uh, I paid someone to make GTA 6. So yeah, here's what I did. I went onto a website called Fiverr.com. You know, they have a ton of very, very talented people who make games on there. Now, I found someone who looked like they were really good at making games. So I asked them to make GTA 6. Now, I was on a budget. I paid $550 for GTA 6. And I was willing to pay more. But I asked this guy to make GTA 6 for me. And he did. And he did a great job great job. I put in the order for GTA 6 on the 21st of May, and he finished the game on June 2nd. So about 12 days or so. Now I'm very impressed with how this game looks and, and plays, and we're gonna get into that. But before we do, I have a sponsor. So let's get into that real quick. I would like to thank the sponsor of this video, Ridge Wallet. The wallet that can hold up to 12 cards with cash that comes with up to 30 colors to choose from. Guys, let's go ask people on the streets if they've ever heard of Ridge Wallet. Hey, hey, hey you. Hey, hey, do you, do you know about Ridge Wallet? Do you know about Ridge Wallet? Hey, stop, don't walk away from me. Do you know about Ridge Wallet? Hey! Do you know about Ridge Wallet? No, oh, sorry. Oh, frick, I didn't mean to do that. Do you know about Ridge Wallet? No? Well, you frickin' should. You should've gone to www.ridgewallet. You should've gone to www.ridgewallet.com and use code INFINITE. And you could've saved up to 10% for Father's Day. Come on, you probably have one of those lame wallets. Hey, come back here. Do you know about Ridge Wallet? You freaking got my ridge wallet. They could have saved up to 10% with my code infinite, guys, and with free shipping. Yes, free. Worldwide shipping and return. And guys, I said this, but it is a perfect gift for Father's Day. You gotta get him a ridge wallet. It's, it's so nice. So guys, old bulky wallets like this. Throw it in the freaking trash. With the ridge wallet, it's super slim and made from durable materials that come with a lifetime warranty. www.ridgewallet.com slash infinite. Do it! Go! Click the link down below. Thank you to Rich Wallet for sponsoring this video. And we're back. Let's get into the gameplay. So you open the game up. Your character slowly floats down to the ground. And you spawn in Manhattan, New York. Now you can pick up all of these weapons. Now the pedestrians in GTA 6 are very, very smart. Now you can go over to them and you can help them out by, uh, by uh, you know, pushing them aside and... and, and Oh, he, he, he punched me. As you can see, the uh, pedestrians in GTA 6 are very, very smart. And you can see their exact emotion right above their head. You see how he's healing over time. Pedestrians heal over time, which is just insane. So you can kill them, obviously, like any other game, and he will be dead. And, of course, you can uh, jump and you can crouch. Because what would be a Grand Theft Auto game if you couldn't do this. Now you're probably thinking Grand Theft Auto means stealing cars. Um, and as you can see, there is cars on the map shotgun. You can switch to your other gun and you shoot. Ooh. You hear that sound effect? That's a meaty shotgun. The pedestrians are much stronger. You know, you're not gonna just die from one shotgun bullet. Cars in Grand Theft Auto 6 are very nice. And as you can see, look at that beautiful, look at that detail. Footprints. So, so, you, so you can, Okay, anyways, moving on to the cars. Y you get in. Look at this. You have a full 360 view of the car. Absolutely gorgeous color. Obviously, you can drive the car. Of course. It's a, it's a Grand Theft Auto game. You can also change the POV just like in any other Grand Theft Auto game. Look at this. It's like a freaking movie. Now, you're definitely wanting to know what happens when I run over someone. Let's test it out. And as you can see, very nice car physics. Look at that damage. Realistic crashes only. Let's run over this pedestrian. Very realistic. And the map, the map is so nice. There's a bunch of nature, there's buildings. Let me just explore the map real quick. Oh, frick. I was just, I just was showing you the uh, realistic crash feature as you can see car is completely destroyed also another terrible feature from gta 5 traffic no one likes traffic so we removed traffic completely as you can see we're on the freeway and there is no traffic and it is absolutely beautiful 
I can drive for miles and have no one hit me. Look at that driving. Look at my freaking driving abilities. I'm already a professional at this game. As you can see, this map is absolute- Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, frick. Oh my god. So, do you see how immersive that was? Did you see how- As you can see, the map just keeps going. The map is like Minecraft. It just keeps on going. It's infinite. Uh, it's just a minor bug. Pretty easy to fix. There are so many different kinds of weapons. This one even comes with a laser. They give you very mean looks if you shoot them in the face. Just like in real life. Dead. Just like in real life. There are so many fun things to explore about this game. As you can see, I'm coming up on one of the other vehicles in GTA 6. This one is very fun. It is the Apache helicopter. Let's hop in. So as you can see, it gives you a nice little tutorial. This isn't a thing in GTA 5 or 4 or 3 or any of them. Alright, I, I would like... I would like if the tutorial went away. Um, click to continue. Oh, I accidentally pre... Let's just try that again. What are you looking at, buddy? Huh? Trick shot. <laughs> Let me in! Let me in! Oh, I did it. I did it. I clicked to continue. I did it. And we landed on top of the roof. Oh. I'm stuck up here. I'm literally stuck on a building now. I am stuck on a building. Okay, I'm jumping. Oh my god. Okay, can I- will I survive? Uh, what? In GTA 5, you can't just walk into any interior. In GTA 6, you can. As you can see, we have a beautiful diner. N Nando. Nand <laughs> Nando's Pizza. <laughs> FaZe Clan, oh my god. I'm trickshotting in a, in, a, in a game that's not even out yet. Oh, baby. <gasps> oh! Physics in GTA 6. That is what I'm talking about. Look at those physics, dude. You don't see that in GTA 6 you, or 5. Now, if you guys want me to do a, another video where I test some things, I, I can have him add more things to this game. Like building, like Fortnite. Let me know if I should do that. 100,000 likes, sure. And I'll, I'll, keep, <laughs> I'll keep making this game into GTA 7. I'm on a building and I want to just jump off. Because that's another thing about GTA 5 that's fun. You jump off building. You do the cheat codes, you go up in the air, and then you fall to your death. It's fun. So let's just see what happens. <laughs> Perfect. No fall damage in GTA 6. It's, uh, it's just like real life. Nope, nope. Don't test that. GTA 6, it's a wonderful game. Did I waste my money? There's just some minor bugs, guys. So that is the story of me paying someone to make GTA 6 early. <laughs> Consider subscribing, and maybe I'll do this, but with Minecraft 2. <laughs> Goodbye.